Okay, well, th guys, thanks for joining once again. We, uh... Huh. What were we doing? Oh. Hmm. Need to grab our next six packs. OG Dominaria. And after this, we'll either jump to Japanese Strixhaven or Commander Legends, the original, the OG. So in that one, what we're hunting for is basically the Lotus. That is what we're hunting for there. Uh, what we're technically hunting for over here really is the Mox Amber. Because, you know, it's a Mox, baby. Uh, Academy Journey Mage. And I would suspect that basically going hunting Memorial to Genius that we'll probably only do this not that often. We got another rare. Yagamoth's Vile Offering. Slin Voda the Rising Deep Leviathan 8 8 for an 8 drop. That's how I. Okay. There is a bit of a distinction. Commons, uncommons. Yeah. So, so we are looking for that Mox Amber. And then we'll be looking for Jeweled Lotus. And then Demonic Tutor. Now, now that you guys know at this point what we're on the hunt for, Rat Colony, that's cool. Like a Rat Deck. Uh, Avon Sentry, if we find each of those before we run out of packs, then I plan to take three of the remaining packs. Uh, from basically as we go through each of these uh, sets and I plan to set those aside and put those into a uh, basically a box that I will be shipping off here uh, and by the time this video airs we'll have gone out to Dread Shade for rare miss the we were jumping already there we'll have gone to uh, Big Box Dave, uh, MTG, MTG Attitude, uh, for uh, basically him to uh, pass along to uh, along with some other things that I've already put in there, but I'll show those later, uh, to pass along to um, <coughs> um, pass along to another YouTuber, uh, Paz Brown. So pause Brown, pause. Um, he's a great uh, asset to the MTG community. Pause is a uh, single father, the Tolarian scholar. Uh, he works hard, um, tries to uh, use, basically gets, uh, goes to and enjoys magic though and shares what he's got though uh, but he's uh, uh, basically he's with everything as you guys know prices are going up though for everything and that's Keldon Reader and I'm blessed that my wife and I both have good jobs and my wife uh, is better at managing money than I am um, but one of the things that that I've done here and that I'm going to be doing um, obviously this week uh, Sarah Angel there, there we go original Sarah well not original but uh, Sarah Angel um, I'm going to be doing here uh, and actually this is why I'm kind of tired and why I've been doing some the shorts you'll see is that been uh, we had um, I work for a cable company uh, I won't say which one for obvious reasons but I work for a cable company, uh, 
we basically had a, uh, as you guys know, there was uh, this uh, basically little, uh, it wasn't little, Hurricane uh, Ian that basically hit uh, a number of our, our customers though and uh, we have been providing support to get them back up and running. Uh, we hope that uh, basically uh, everyone who is down in the Florida though, uh, basically that was impacted by Ian, my personally though I should say, that everyone's well. Well, as, uh, as such though, there's been the opportunity uh, basically for the position I do to work some overtime. And so I've taken advantage of that though. I, it's basically, <laughs> it's, uh, I'm showing the, basically being tired. So is this a, okay, so it is a five drop. Okay, I thought I was gonna say, is it a seven drop? The dampening sphere again. So, um, what basically, weight of memory, so, with that time, and I'm hoping to get some more, continue to basically get some overtime for before, uh, basically between now and the new year to basically to make up for it. But I know how the struggle is though. I'm gonna brayer here. And so, Avara Hasselon Witness. Okay. So I know how the, basically the struggle is so, uh, as such, so uh, <clears throat> we've learned that uh, from uh, basically a request from uh, MG, MTG Attitude, uh, Big Box Dave and crew were there, that uh, basically they want to do something to help out, uh, basically pause though, uh, because <coughs> he, uh, he's getting, he's been, because of uh, basically the advantage of, or the advantage, I wouldn't say real advantage, but basically because of the essentially set, thing, basically if you will, certain um, price controls, I guess you would say, that were put into place because of COVID though, um, helped uh, a, a lot of people out. Um, and now, you know, a lot of those are starting to expire, and a lot of people uh, did the right thing, have been doing the right thing, though, like pause, where they basically have made sure that uh, they have basically been, you know, doing everything that they can to basically make sure that they're taking care of things, though, and uh, such, though, but with the rising cost of everything it, it, it basically is going to make it a much more challenging environment for a number of people though so uh, like I said it uh, brings me to basically the what we're, what big box day that is doing though and that is basically going to be putting together a live stream though and some uh, stuff though for uh, to help out with uh, for pause and such, though. Katara, uh, Karn's Temporal Sundry. Rare. So, that brings me to what basically I've been, what I've done here is that, like I said, I had already had some of these um, basically the boxes uh, already in on order or ordered and already in place like the Dominaria, uh, like the uh, Commander Legend, so, and the Strict Saber. So, <clears throat> and I've got some other packs that basically that, uh, that I've got though. So, uh, as an example though, I had the uh, Dominaria United draft pack box that I had sealed though that I opened. I put some of those in uh, to a uh, basically, though, um, I've also put in uh, uh, some of those uh, Zendikar uh, packs, the uh, draft booster, I think, uh, set draft. So, set draft and a uh, Japanese uh, version. Uh, you guys will see when I do the video, though, that basically what's kind of going to be in there 
um, and basically that is going to go uh, out to Wizards Lightning. Going to go out to uh, get shipped out here. So we're going to seal it away and we're going to ship it off. And then when it gets to its destination, uh, it's going to uh, basically uh, uh, go uh, join whatever uh, other basically uh, things that uh, Paws receives though, or that Big Box Dave receives that he's then going to hand over on a uh, basically a mystery box opening for Paws. They got a rare here. Uh, Avrid Knight of Wind Grease. And so, uh, it's going to be really cool though. I am quite happy to be able to help though. Um, also, uh, I will be, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do yet though, but I know that um, by the time this goes up, of course, um, as well though, Paws will already have seen and opened it up though, so this will not be a surprise though at that point because he will have basically already had the surprise. Uh, the other thing that I'm going to say, grow from ashes, is that I'm still thinking about uh, how I might be able to help out uh, uh, basically another YouTuber, uh, Luke uh, Bus. Apparently his um, uncle passed away though, and so he's doing some uh, basically stuff though to promote that though. Uh, that he's well, not promote that he's uncle passed away, but he's actually promoting or doing a raffle giveaway um, to basically raise uh, some funds to help out his uncle's family, though, uh, at this point. Amrathorn Wall, and I, uh, I may have. If I may have an, I may have some possibilities though that I might be able to do. Um, Cliff Trop Retreat for a rare. That's a third in the land cycle. Slave Foot Stillway. Okay. So that is going to wrap up that. Okay, guys. Um, yeah. So. We are now two-thirds of the way through the box, though, and um, we'll basically keep going here. Um, actually, you know what we are going to do? Kind of a surprise here, though, at this part. So, this is uh, basically an old-school, uh, uh, basically, a box of starter boxes for Hyborian Gates, so. though. Um, something that I have played years ago. Uh, I was able to get a snag. I've got a box though, a uh, pack though, but um, I haven't done my um, any of my recent uh, videos on my Throwback Thursdays, which I need to get back to doing as soon as I can. Um, and you may see that though before you see this, so you probably will. But what we're going to do here? Uh, so if you see, so by the time you, if you see me doing one of these though at some point though on a Throwback Thursday, before this video, um, or I guess after, but before then you'll know that what we're going to do is we're going to grab, open up. It's a uh, basically this game where magic and technology meet. You got six limited edition starter boxes. So what we're going to do is we're going to reach in here. Actually, you know what we're going to do? we got six of them. I need a... I probably don't have a, basically a six-sided dice handy though. So we're going to do this. Basically, um, twenty-sided dice. That doesn't work. Yeah, it does. Okay, so we're going to roll. Uh, basically, odds are evens. And then we'll pick from there. Okay. 
Oh, I guess that's a 20. So it's going to be even. So uh, we didn't even define. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this would be 20, or these would be the uh, two, four, and six would be even. So an even, uh, basically, number. Um, so, yeah, another even, basically divided up though, I don't know. Okay, so one, that'll work. We'll pick, pick the first uh, even pack. So, we're going to take that out. And we're going to set that aside. And we're going to actually put that into basically causes um, little reward box thing. Or not reward box. It's basically, uh, I don't know why I call it reward box. So it's basically going to go out to pause though uh, as part of my uh, basically to help him out though. He can then choose what he wants to do with it in terms of how he's going to use it in content creation though uh, for his channel. And that's really what it's about. I'm sharing what I can though uh, to help him and give him a chance to use it however he wants to use it uh, to make content though for his channel. Because uh, I know that he had apparently um, and I think it would be cool for him to do some you know deck techs as well. Uh, as you guys know as I get the so I put together and get you know the art cards basically together for sets um, I basically have taken those and then we'll make a series of videos on them. You guys know that I do other videos that will like this here as well though about old style cards or old gaming, car gaming cards though because if I either have them or find them on the cheap though uh, and make them then I will and share them with you guys and so at, you know at some point I'm going to go ahead and get back to Throwback Thursdays um, and we'll do that Thanks guys for oh, watching. I'm gonna go ahead and stop rambling at this point as you guys will see this. Um, and you'll see this again in the future and in the future again. Or actually in the past, depending on <coughs> when this shows up though. Anyway guys, have a great day. Stay safe though, we'll catch you in the next video.